What's up guys, iDevice Help here. Today in this video I'm going to be showing you guys how to downgrade from iOS 9 to iOS 8.3 or 8.4. Now downgrading can be a little tricky depending on which software Apple is currently signing. At this point in time, the filming of this video, Apple is signing iOS 8.3 and 8.4 so you can downgrade to either one at this time. If you have any questions, you can follow me on Twitter and I can answer for you before you do this process. So the first thing you want to do is download the software that you want to downgrade to from iOS 9. I have iOS 8.3. 8.3 there sitting on my desktop. I'll have a link down below to for you guys so you can download the iOS version that it's currently being signed for your device so you can go ahead and restore your device or downgrade your device rather. Now once you download the software that you want to downgrade to make sure you save it to your desktop is the easiest place to find and then you want to connect your device using the USB port to your computer and launch iTunes. On iTunes up here you're going to select your device from the top column there and you're going to want, want to go ahead and save all your pictures and contacts and other information to your computer or iCloud because we're going to be restoring the device that way you don't lose anything so with that being said all you have to do is jump on over here where it says restore and once you download the software and saved all your information to the computer you're going to hold down the option key while clicking on your mouse the restore button in iTunes now at this point in time it could ask you to turn off find my iPhone if it's activated on your device so you just simply go to the settings application go to the iCloud section of your device and turn off find my iPhone and then you can continue with this process now for Windows users you're gonna hold down the shift key and click the restore button so it works the same on Windows and Mac so once you do that I'm gonna go ahead and browse here to my desktop that's where I saved iOS 8.3 there it is 8.3 and I'm going to downgrade from iOS 9 very simple this is how developers do it and Apple allows developers to downgrade because obviously if you're on a beta version you can downgrade to an official iOS version so I'm gonna go ahead and let my device restore for a few seconds here and then I'll come right back once it's done restoring Alright, so after about 5 minutes or so, my device was completely downgraded from iOS 9. As you can see there, I have to go through the setup process. Let me go ahead and do this here quickly. Alright, so there you guys have it. That is how to downgrade from iOS 9 to iOS 8.3 or 8.4. Again, depending on which version of iOS Apple is currently signing. So let me go ahead and give you guys a quick close-up there. There it is, iOS 8.3. So if you have any questions on what version of iOS is currently being signed by the time you watch this video, you can always follow me on Facebook and Twitter. I can answer there or leave a comment down below. I hope you guys have found this video helpful. And in any way, don't forget to leave a thumbs up. It's been iDevice. I hope you guys enjoy the video, and I'll catch you guys really soon. Peace.